welcome back to my channel i'm mickey lee if you don't know who i am and today i'm very excited because today i ran some errands with my mom and we shopped at target so i decided instead of just like unpacking everything and putting it away um i thought i would show you guys some of the things i got okay so first starting off i want um i bought these elf um beauty blenders i have one of the elf ones but um when i'm trying to do my concealer i can never get it in like my inner corner area like under my eyes it's like way too big so i thought i would buy get these ones if i can open it um so it came with a little bit of a small one but once i put water on it um that it will get bigger but there's the bigger one and then it came with a little medium one these are so cute this would probably fit under my eye so this is the little medium one these are so cute um and then this is the tiny one this is so cute i don't even know how you would use this probably if you put water on it it might get bigger that's what it looks like ain't that cute it's so cute okay so next i got this um bathroom organizer it's supposed to be i think a vanity organizer that's what it says on it but i'm gonna put this in my bathroom i'm probably gonna put like toothpaste or something in here and then my toothbrush and stuff um yeah because the one i have it's like the open one so like when i put my toothbrush in it slides into the sink like it goes out of the thing and then it slides into my sink so this will come in handy um so next i got the um these rags for like how much were these i got these for i don't know i think they were like four dollars because before that um i went to kohl's we went to kohl's and it was get the same amount but it was for ten dollars so we went to target and these were pretty cheap but we wanted to get these for i do cleaning i clean my grandma's so because she um she can't do all that bending and so i help and clean for her next um so i saw her name is her channel's name is luzetti and her name was lisette and so I saw that she um, got these Venus razors and um, Venus risers. And this one's the metal handle. So it's kind of neat. I got this for $13 and it already comes with two cartridges, like two blades. So for the environment, like more safe than the disposable ones, but then they, um, they always get dull after like two times using it and so that's what i hate about them but like these ones you're just like um disposing the little blade not the whole thing and just not wasting the whole thing so i found this very neat next i got these two um they're basically little pot thingies i don't know what they're called but you're supposed to you put like your cotton rounds in it or your cotton balls or whatever in it because the one I have, it's clear, but it's so old that it kind of has this yellowish, yellowish tint. And it gets, you can see the dust that builds up on them. Well, you should be dusting anything in your bathroom to keep it more sanitary. But I just like need kind of like a renew, re sort of thing in my bathroom. And I plan on getting those, like they're acrylic makeup holder thingies because my makeup I don't have a whole lot of makeup, but my makeup is like sitting in this one thing on the side of my, um, on the side of my sink and it just doesn't stay there very well. It slides into the sink and stuff. And then, um, yeah, next. Okay. So I'm a sucker for fun band-aids, like the, um, the Disney ones and stuff. Um, so I got these ones. <laughs> I love Despicable Me and the Minions are hilarious. I just think these are fun to wear. They make my ouchies feel better. Next. Okay. So, um, 
Whenever I wear makeup, I use a cleansing balm because I double cleanse. And so I don't like using my washcloth to wipe off this stuff because about the cleansing balm, I can't just rinse it off with my hands. I have to like use a gentle um, washcloth to kind of wipe it off or like a cotton round thingy. But um, cotton rounds are kind of, um, um, probably you should buy um, the, the reusable ones. And the washcloth, I like to usually use for my face to dry it off. I don't like to use my, my hair towel or my body towel because that can have um, bacteria from other places that you really don't want to get on your face because then it can cause acne and you really don't know why it's happening, but it's kind of a vicious cycle if you keep doing that. So these were $10. Um, these were much cheap. I think these are a little bit cheaper than the actual makeup erasers, like the original ones. So I found these at Target. I got these two colors because they're my favorite colors. The teal aqua sort of color and the purple lavender color. So I thought I would use these, um, to like remove my makeup or if I'm doing a, a face mask, um, like the charcoal one um, gets all over the place and it's just like, these are a little bit cleaner and these are washable. These things, these are so gentle. Like these are like really nice. They're really gentle. So like if I were to use it on my face, it wouldn't hurt my face because I know washcloths are a little bit harder on your face. They're probably more meant to um, to dry off your face. Like you're um, dabbing your face to dry it not really for like wiping off stuff or washing your face because I've seen, or you use it for your overall body trying to wash your face instead of using a loofah like this. This is a new loofah <laughs> that wasn't from Target. It was from a different, um, I went to my nearby drugstore. So yeah. Uh, next I got this because it's the Vaseline cocoa butter one. They have a rosy one. A rosy lips one which is like the tinted one and then they have the normal one which is like you can just buy the big tub for it but i like to use this one because like i've used the Burt's bees one and it doesn't really hydrate my lips it kind of burns my lips a little um because i have more sensitive skin and with the mint inside of it it's like too concentrated so it doesn't really um moisturize my lips Okay, so next, I, I've i heard lots of good reviews on this. So this is the e.l.f. Um, lip exfoliator. I got the one in coconut, and I've heard many good reviews on this. Um, a lot of people like the brown sugar. There's the sweet cherry one, and then it's the mint maniac, I think that's what it's called. Um, they have these at Target. These are a little bit more easier to use because it's in the actual um, lipstick tube. So the next thing I got was the NYX Professional Makeup Tinted Brow Mascara. And so I've used a NYX, not NYX, it was an e.l.f., um, the fluffy brow pencil, but it was really, like, it was more bigger. It was a bigger brow pencil, and I'm not very skilled with it, per se. So I find this would probably be easier for me. It might, um... Like the brow pencil might be easier for other people. Next, I got these um, Ardell brow, Pro Brow Trim and Shape Quick and Easy um, razors. They were like razors, face razors. So I saw a girl who said that this helps your skincare penetrate more into your skin. And so since I have more, um, my skin is super dry, but since the hairs are on my, on my face are kind of like, kind of stopping the skincare, mostly penetrating into my skin, I thought I would try this. And lots of people say it grows back really thick, but I think that's kind of a lie because it really, your hair has, um, has, um, memory, has like, cell memory i think that's what it's called so it will grow back in the same place it won't grow like three hairs in one hair follicle thing i don't know so i thought i would try this um and it also helps your makeup lay um lay down better um the next thing i got is from pixie 
by Petra. I thought I would get this one because I like my skin to be more plumped and hydrated. And this one is the Pixie Collagen Plumping, Plumping Mask. I wouldn't use this that often. Um, I probably would just like, I know it's a leave on absorbing mask, but I don't like to leave on those things on my face. I probably would use it for like 10 minutes, 15 to 10, 10 to 15 minutes on my face. Um, then I got this Bliss um spa to go resurfacing 10 minute enzyme facial i think this one's made of pumpkin i think so now for one of the things i'm so excited for i've been debating on getting one of get, getting these for a long time so um i like to do face masks i like to do i like to treat myself i like to do my nails i like to do pedicures um and I like to do skincare and stuff like that. So, um, I've done one eye mask, and I think in my lifetime, um, it was the Bliss eye mask, and that one was okay. It was okay. But I know one person, her Cassandra Bankson did it in her like uh, Target skincare video or something like that, and she. Um, I think had an allergic reaction to it and I allergic reaction to it for what ingredient was in there. So I got the Pixie Skin Treats um, Detoxify Eye thing. Um, it's the caffeine and cucumber one and it's for depuffing. I have um, dark circles and sometimes um, mine, my under eyes can get really puffy sometimes. Um, if you're wondering why I keep looking up, it's because there's a mirror right there. So, I got this one. And let's open it up. I really want to see what it looks like because I've seen lots of people use these. I haven't gotten a jar. I've gotten, like, the little packages with everything in it. But, um, let's open it. This is so cute. I love the packaging because I love, like, the green packaging. It always thinks of... It's like Tinkerbell. So this is what it looks like. It has a blue cap and then it has the pixie. Um, I bet it's probably sealed because that's how. Oh, this is so cool. It comes with a little spatula. If you guys are like, what is wrong with this person? I get excited for the most weirdest things. I got excited when I was getting my braces and stuff. Whoa, ew. It doesn't smell. It smells like packaging. Probably because it was in packaging. That's what it looks like. Look at, oh, that's very, that's very, um. That is so cool. How many is in here? I wonder how much is in here for the price that I paid for it. Um, 30 pairs. That is so, that's like a great deal. I know, um, there's, I'm more familiar with this brand. So when I looked on Amazon for other eye patches that probably were cheaper, um, I didn't feel comfortable because a lot of them kept saying, well, I had this allergic reaction or to this product or, um, well, it's not the same for everybody. It might be like the product has lots of fragrance and the fragrance after using it after a while, um, you can get con contact tuberculitis where it's like a gradual like like after gradually using it you can um you can come up with having an allergic reaction to that product because of the fragrance but um like i forget what company what um youtuber said this but they say um some products use fragrance as like a sustainability thing or like they use it for like a um or for something um so yeah eye patches and i know another eye patch um they said it smells like flarp well i had an allergic reaction to flarp once so did not want to buy this that one so i thought i'd buy the pixie one because i've heard that it was really good and yeah well guys i hope you liked my video um i just I think that this was kind of more of a like self-guided video. 
it's not it was really kind of like a last minute thing um and so i hope you guys give this video a big thumbs up um su subscribe down below and give a comment um I'm sorry that my comments are disabled and I really don't know how to fix that at this moment. And so since I'm still growing as a YouTuber and I hope you guys do subscribe so I can grow, um, I might be able to have people comment on my videos to give me feedback, to, um, to give me more ideas for my YouTube videos. I would really like to hear you guys' you, ideas. I'm thinking about doing like a self-care day doing my nails because my nails look sad i need to do my nails so badly i haven't had i use poly gel as you could have seen from my very first video i like to use poly gel on my nails i need a pedicure because um yeah my toes haven't had paint in a long time on them and so they need to i want to do a face mask give myself a luxury day bye guys see you in the next one